I'm Brian from Syntax Technologies. You can contact me with this information. We'll continue with our SQL Accounting System training. And in today's lesson, I'll talk about stock adjustment. We go to SQL Accounting System. We go to the stock module. And you can find the stock adjustment over here. Again, you must have the stock module. Only then you can do this stock adjustment. Now, stock adjustment will always follow with a stock checking first. To do that, just go to your stock at the top, go to print stock physical worksheet, okay, then apply. You can also do the stock physical worksheet according to location or other criteria over here. So we preview, okay. So this is what we call a stock take sheet or stock check. Okay, now you need to print out this document Go to your warehouse and do the stock check one by one. Now, in old days, normally people would not do stock control. The reason is, the first thing is you need to imagine you have 1,000 items. Then you need to physically count 1,000 times. And for example, this item, uh, this item antenna, you know, better is blue pen. Blue pen, you have 32. So you counted the actual quantity on hand is 30. So at the physical quantity column, you need to write down 30. Remarks, you need to write down negative 2. Okay, negative 2. Because you need to adjust in the stock adjustment one by one. So meaning for 1,000 items, you need to do 3,000 steps. 1,000 for physical check, 1,000 mathematics, and 1,000 key in. So 3,000 steps for 1,000 items. That's the main reason why people do not do stock control all days. But after GST era, you must do stock control, okay? Then in SQL, we'll help you not 100%, we'll help you uh, a bit on this part. Still the same, you need to print out this physical worksheet and you need to do the physical count one by one. So you have 1,000 steps. But you can ignore the mathematics. That means you do not need to write down negative 2 over here. You just need to write down 30, okay? Then what you need to do is you put your stock physical worksheet over here, make it smaller, and then you open up your stock adjustment. Go to stock, stock adjustment. Okay, this is the previous adjustment. We click new. Okay, you make it side by side. Okay, now over here, the stock adjustment, you must make sure there's three columns must appear. Book quantity, quantity and physical quantity. And if you can't see this column, what you need to do is very simple. You can actually right click at any column title. For example, you right click item code. Okay. Go to field chooser. Then go here and select. For example, initially there's no, it's not inside. It looks something like this for you. So again, you just need to right click any column title, example item code, right click, field chooser. Then you scroll and look for this tree. The first one is book quantity, you drag, drop. And then must make sure there is a quantity, drag, drop. And also physical quantity. Let's say you can't do this field chooser. You don't know what is right click field chooser. Then there's a very small button over here with a lot of arrows, lines. Just click this small button and go and look for physical quantity here. Just tick your physical quantity is here. Now, I want you to arrange the column according like what I did now. It should be book quantity, quantity, then only physical quantity. Why is that so? show you later now you have all the column ready then you go back to your stock physical worksheet then you click the first item and at the keyboard you click ctrl a that means select all if not then you can just click the first one click the shift key go to the last item click again also can okay either ctrl a that means select all or sh click the first item click shift Go to the last item, click again, then it's select all. So what you need to do is just drag left click, don't release, 
and drag release the item the, 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 the finger over here so you can see that the whole things will move from the right hand side to the left hand side that means from your stock physical worksheet to the stock adjustment you do not need to key in one by one so you save 1000 steps okay now what you need to do is if you still remember the in the blue pen physically we counted 30 so we should adjust negative 2 but I have told you you should you do not need to do the negative 2 so what I do is key in the physical quantity according to what you have written down at your physical worksheet 30 and take note on this part when you enter the negative 2 will appear meaning that the system calculate for you for the stock adjustment okay so you just key according to what you have written in your physical worksheet that's simple okay now remember your balance on hand must always same as the balance in the system so you need to adjust and do stock take regularly why because if you're GST registered company when you purchase the item there is GST okay so when you sell off there is output tax and you need to get from your customer and pay to custom of course you cannot tell custom that oh I have 10 items missing so I just adjust it then I don't care you cannot do that you must make sure the stock quantity on hand is always same as what you have inside your system so hope you can understand how this stock adjustment work and if you do want to have more information regarding GST or SQL you can just go to my Facebook it's facebook.com slash syntax technologies you can all have all the latest info and please help me to like my page also and for all other tutorial video which you would like to refer to just go to my website is syntax.com.my click on the YouTube and here you go all my SQL tutorial video okay so that's all for today and once again I'm Brian from syntax technologies thank you